guys, what is up? It's your girl Gigi, you know, what's up, you know, what up? Just kidding. <laughs> so to, in today's video, I'm gonna be reviewing the new Norvina 3 palette. Oh my God, I just got it in yesterday. So freaking cute, look at this, so cute. It's just a beautiful packaging. It's just Norvina right here. ABH Norvina collection. It looks like this, you guys. Again, it came out, it came with a full-size mirror as the other ones, too. And it just feels really nice. It has some weight to it, you guys, so it does feel it's worth the money, you know? It feels like, you know, it feels expensive, and it is expensive. <laughs> $60. Um, if you guys want to see how I got this look, then just keep on watching. I do have a shirt on, like always. It's just a tube top, so whatever. Um... I'm going to be reviewing the Norvina 3, Volume 3 palette. You guys, I just got this in the mail yesterday. So I'm super, 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 super excited to be reviewing all the palettes. Um, well, talking about them, I'm going to be reviewing this one. I did do a tutorial and everything for the Volume 1, but I just didn't like how... The footage looked, um, the look was amazing. Um, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys would know what look I did. And for my second look that I did using the Volume 2 palette, along with the Volume 1 together, was fire. So I'll show you guys the look that I did if you guys haven't checked it out. It's fire, in my opinion, I love it. It looks like this, I don't know if you guys could see it, but, I I wish you guys could see the look. Do you see that? Oh my gosh. That's your girl. <laughs> I know I look ugly right now. But I did get inspired by Vivian. This girl. Um, you guys could check it out on my Instagram. I will do I will have her link down below, like her Instagram. Um, so yeah, um, this palette, the volume two palette is amazing. For people that want to venture out and be creative, I think um, it's for anybody. But if you guys want to get out of your comfort zone, for sure, this would be an amazing palette for you. So good. Usually, I have so much trouble with blues. Like, it's not even funny. Like, I do. I do. I have, I have so much trouble. But this palette, um, there was no fallout. Um, for me, I don't know, the way my techniques are just patting down on the eyeshadow and then packing it on. I don't rub, I don't swirl, you know what I mean? So, I don't know if it's just that, but I loved it. So, for the volume three, oh my god, guys. I'm so excited. Okay, so it came in a beautiful box like this. It looks so cute, you guys. It is um, like a corally color with gold butterflies so pretty it's come like this um again we do get a primer and if you guys haven't used the primer um i love it i love it so much i'm so happy i have like four primers right now i don't think i'm ever gonna run out seriously <laughs> the packaging for this is the same as the packaging of the cover and the box it's just these pretty butterflies so cute wow right it, this is the fall palette so, and then come with a mirror it's like a full full size mirror it's so amazing i love it you guys it's so cute so i did one eye off camera um yes i love it so cute all right i'm gonna be taking the color a1 it looks like this this is a1 it's like that neon greenish color right here so yeah I'm really loving the the color scheme of this palette I think this palette has to be one of my favorites because it's more of a wearable type of palette you have your browns your pop of color your shimmers and yeah I just love it I love, 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 love it. It's so pretty. So this color does have kickback, but that's because I'm just like going in, girl. Okay, so this color is pretty bright. 
So you can definitely see that the pigment is there. I feel like there's like a, yeah, like a pigment. Okay, so now that I have that color down, I am gonna be taking the color E3. This, it's like the pastel-y, orangey color. So I'm gonna be taking that color right here, just packing it little by little. So that's how much I want and the rest is going to be the color B3 and it's like a like a pink like a, a strawberry fuchsia pink so it looks like this B3 like that color and it is pretty pigmented okay I love how the look came out it's so pretty and I use their new glitters I'm not sure if the glitter that I use is new, but I use their glitters today. I haven't done anything with glitter in a long time. And if you are an OG, you guys know that back then every look had glitter, you know? I was literally like the glitter queen. I'm just gonna put that out there. <laughs> I'm just going back like, you know, with the colors, back and forth. can blend better that's all you gotta do you know basically when you want to do looks you just gotta go back and forth back and forth because then you lose color then you want to pack on more color but yeah okay so I'm gonna leave that right there I'm gonna get the my favorite brush where is it at I just had it okay 507 brush that one's my favorite brush it looks like this yeah I love it it's perfect for my hooded eyes it's just go in with the a1 which was the neon green color and I'm just gonna blend it upwards to my brows pretty much you know then I'm gonna take the e3 and do the same thing just to blend it over here Okay, so now I'm gonna go in with the B3, which is the pink one, and just go in and blending it. So I noticed that this eye is my troubled eye, and this is the side that I always take pictures on, so this is my left. Pro Concealer, the 105 from Frankie Rose. I've been loving this concealer brush. Um, it's pretty big, but it just gets the work done and fast, and I could just stamp on the concealer or my eyeshadow primer, stuff like that. So I think it's really good. Like, it doesn't have that much fallout. Um, so, yeah. It's just easy. This thing is just like one and done, kind of. This brush, I don't know what it is. I just love it. here this is their adhesive so I did receive their glitters I don't know if all of them are new but these glitters are so pretty and they came in this beautiful packaging right here this so these are the glitters it does come with the glitter adhesive right here it is it's called the flower child so pretty it looks like this I don't know if you guys could see the glitter but it just Put some glitter on. I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna talk. I'm just gonna use the adhesive here that they have. It looks like.
All right, guys, so this is the completed look, um, the completed eye look. So I went ahead and um, uh, Urban Decay 24-hour Glide-On Pencil in Perversion. Um, this is super, super, super black. Oh, my God, very creamy. And, yeah, and I popped on some lashes. They're, these are these are from Drea Makeup in the style Espina. This is how it looks. It's my favorite. I'm so sad. Don't get drunk and wear your favorite lashes because I lost... I lost my Libra lashes from Drea Makeup. I'm so sad. But I'm gonna purchase them because they're so bomb. Her lashes are amazing. I forgot to mention, I just put um, color, the eyeshadow C1. Oh my God, do you guys see this? It just made it pop even more. Oh my God, I'm in love. So it's this one right here. This one, so pretty. I'm using this bomb highlighter from Tarte. It's called Tartlet Chrome Paint in the cut, no, yeah. Tart, so it's tart lit chrome paint like it's in a jar it's so underrated I never even see anybody like using this highlighter and it's hella bomb like so pretty and it comes with um, let me see it comes with 16 grams so and this smells good my all-nighter spray this one right here, um, you guys already know I'm obsessed with this. In my ABH highlighter brush, and it's in the in the number A23. It's so good, you guys. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and spray my face. Product on here, tap because this is literally intense, like no joke, like it's it's super intense. I'm going little little by little because if not, I'm gonna be looking like a damn disco ball which is not a problem but you know then it starts like getting all weird and I want it to be little by little so it can look bomb do you see this you guys I feel like a damn goddess I don't know what it is I just love it I want to talk also about this powder oh my god so it's the ultimate brush set and go off by Urban Decay. You guys, this powder is really good. Like bomb, like bomb good. I am using the color Universal. I forgot to bake my nails real quick. So I'm using the color Universal and honestly, it's, it's amazing. So they went ahead and sent over the whole collection of powders. So you have your fair medium dark and deep and the universal color so this is the one sweet tea it's a lip liner by morphe Go ahead and use the Too faced peach puff diffuse matte lipstick it is i think it's called you wish you wish you know so long. So you just, it's a twisty and the product comes on the little sponge or the little puff thingy it has. And yeah. I love it. So yeah. So that's about it. I will be back right now. I'm going to do my hair because I know my hair looks crazy. And I cut my hair, you guys. Like, it's still long, but it's not that long anymore. It's not that long. Guys, I love it. I think it looks so cute. Um, I did get inspired. I got inspired by my girl. Oh, and her name is Leslie Marie 1213 on Instagram. This is her. I got inspired. I'm going to show you guys the look. Um, she did something else, but I used the same color combo and, like, same in order, kind of. So this is her, she's so gorgeous. If you guys don't follow her, what are you guys doing? She's so pretty. It reminds me of like butterflies and stuff like that. And you know the campaign is butterflies, so. Place Honey Love MAC, this is the only MAC lipstick I, have, I, I ever have. I mean, I have right now. I used to have so many MAC lipsticks, it was ridiculous. But I just got to a point where um, it didn't wow me anymore, you know? But Honey Love is an OG, you know. You, you can't go wrong with that one. So I'm just gonna place it in the center to give it like more like a little pout. <laughs> so this is the completed look, you guys. I am obsessed. Um, it's so pretty. 
the colors blended out amazing. The glitter is amazing. I love glitter. I don't know if you guys like glitter, but I love glitter. Like, glitter is everything. This is the look I created with the Norvina Volume 3. Um, it's so cute, you guys. You guys need it. It's perfect for fall. Perfect. And it, look, I did a color, colorful look. And... I, you can do a lot of looks with this palette. I feel it is it's sixty dollars. It does come out thick. by the time when you guys see this video, the palette would will be released. So um, my thoughts on them: one, Norvina two, and Norvina three. You guys, these palettes are all amazing. Okay, do you guys need them all? Probably not. You guys, um, it's more like if you want them, I suggest, yeah, get them. Get them, and if you have the money, because they are pricey, $60 for each one, it's a lot of money, and I know that, and I don't expect you guys to rush out and go get it. The eye primer, I love the eye primer so much. It just intensifies the color. Um, so, yeah, um, I don't know, I just like it. I like these palettes. They are um, really easy to blend. Um, I, don't, I didn't have any trouble with any of them. I already did three looks using all these palettes. So my final thoughts is yes, they are worth it if you guys want to check them out or feel like you want them. Just, you got, like I said on my Instagram, if you could only get one, get the one that you're gonna use. You know what I mean? Get the one that you're gonna use and if you want to venture out, be creative, get the two is so pretty so freaking pretty um the the first the number one is one of my favorites too because you have all the shades this white is amazing um all the shades are so pigmented the pinks and everything they're just bomb so this one too um i use three shades in this palette being a1 b3 and e3 so I didn't have any trouble with any of them. They're super pigmented. And yeah, so I feel like, yeah, if you want to get them, get them. Get them, get them. If you wanna get one, get, get that one, you know? I'm so excited to be able to review these palettes for you guys. Uh, I'm sorry for being gone so long and I forgot that um, they did send over these hair clips. So cute. Um, on my video I said I liked, I, li I really like them because but I'm gonna put one on. I like it because they're huge. They're big, you know? I have thick hair, so they're like this big. So usually they're like smaller like this and, and it doesn't hold your hair at all, Sessed. So yeah, I think you guys, um, if you guys wanna try them, I don't know if they're on sale or whatever, but if you guys want to try them, they're cute. And they, they're tight, they, they're holding my hair. like. Thank you guys for being here. I truly appreciate you guys all the time. I see your guys' comments. Like I said, I'm more active on Instagram. If you guys ever need me or want to ask me a quick question, you guys can find me on Instagram quicker than here because I, I know it's harder here, you know? But yeah. So the glitters, um, the glitters are, they were really nice. I love the glitters. They're super, um, I used the, the Flower Child, yeah. I used Flower Child and it didn't have no fall. I don't have no glitter on my face, you know? So that's good. Doing more looks with the palette. Just let me know what palette you guys want me to use and I will do another look for you guys. Let me know. Everything will be down below. Make sure you guys hit the subscribe button, hit the bell notification so you guys can know every time I post. I love you guys so, so freaking much. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for just, you know, Believing in me. Don't wait to be kind. Just kidding. I love you guys. Thank you. Until next time. Bye guys.